All right. Take a moment. See yourself sitting where you are. Feet on the floor. Go reach down and grow roots from our feet. Go grow them down through the floor, through the basements, and down into the soil far beneath where we are. You go push the roots down around the rocks, around the boulders, until we can find that pool of water deep beneath you. The waters of chaos, waters of potential. Can reach down into those waters. We're going to slowly bring these waters up into our bodies. With each and every breath, bring these waters up and up. Bring them into your feet and into your legs. As you take another breath in, bring them up into your loins and into your belly. Feel the waters move up your body as you bring them up into your chest. Bring them up into your head. And as you keep on breathing, keep on pulling it up until they come out of your head and out of your hands, flowing back into the earth. Feel these cool waters running throughout your bodies, filling yourselves with this energy from far below. Now, turn your attention, attention above. We're going to grow our branches up, grow them up through the ceilings, up through the roofs. Grow the branches up through the clouds and the rain, up high into the sky, till you can find that one star directly above your head. Keep on growing up. We're going to pull the fires from above, the fires of order, fires of potential. We're going to pull these fires down into our bodies. With each and every breath, we bring them down through our branches. Bring them down into our heads and into our chests. And as you breathe, bring them down further into our bellies and into our loins. And we keep on breathing and keep on pulling them down into our legs and into our feet. If you look at yourself now, you can see yourself glowing with the fires from above and the waters from below, mixing throughout your body, filling you with order and chaos, the powers of potential. Take of these, drink of them strongly, take whatever you need out of them to bring yourself back to your normal center. Enjoy these energies. And when you're ready, push the waters back into the earth. Push the fires back into the sky. But know that if you ever need them, you can always just reach down and pull up and bring them back into your bodies. But for now, disconnect them both. Take a deep breath in and out, in and out. When you're ready, open your eyes, prepare for magic. We are here to honor the gods the ancestors and the land spirits. But first, let us hallow our hallows. Mighty waters, you run deep into the earth, connecting to the wells far below and the lands of the ancestors. To you, we give you the silver and we say sacred waters flow within us. Sacred waters flow within us. Mighty fires, you burn and transform. You send our offerings up into the heavens to the shining ones. We offer you this incense. You say, sacred fires burn within us. Sacred fires burn within us. And incense, please stay lit. Oh, when? A mighty tree. Your roots go deep into the earth, to the wells far below. Your branches go high into the sky, to the shining ones far above. We give you the water of the wells and the incense of the fire. We say, sacred tree, grow within us. Sacred tree, 
grow within us. By the might of the water, the light of the fire, each and every one of our groves are made whole and holy. By the might of the water and the light of the fire, our groves are made whole and holy. By the might of the water and the light of the fire, our groves are made whole and holy. So be it. So be it. We call to the gatekeepers, to all of you who have aided us in the past, we call to you to aid us once more. Watch over us as we do our works this evening. Guide us to where we need to go. Take our words far and wide. Bring back to us what we need to hear. Gatekeepers all, all accept our offerings. Accept our offerings. And of course, gatekeepers, my mind is elsewhere today. So we'll back up one second. It's, I'll make offerings to the Earth Mother. Earth Mother, you surround us and you support us. You aid us and you guide us. Without you, we would not be here. Without you, we would not have the shelter and the food that we have. For everything that you do for us, and with grace, apologies for skipping your part. Earth Mother, accept our offerings. Earth Spirit, accept our offerings. So now, gatekeepers, we ask that you join your magic with ours. Let the wells open. It's the gate to the underworld. Let the fires open. It's a gate to the upper worlds. Let the tree to the crossroads between all the worlds open to our spirits and open to our voices. Let the gates be opened. Let the gates be opened. ancestors to all of you who have come before those of you within our lineage we offer you welcome to all of you who we have chosen our friends our inspiration our mentors our chosen family we offer you welcome and to all of you who are of this very earth who are here long before us we offer you welcome Come, join us by our fires. Ancestors, accept our offerings. Ancestors, accept our offerings. And then to the land spirits, you fur and feather, scale and skin, our animal kin, we offer you welcome. Be you leaf and twig, stem and flower, our plant kin, we offer you welcome. To all of you that are unseen in all the names that you go by, we call to you and we make and we offer you welcome. Come and join us by our fires. Land spirits, accept our offerings. Land spirits, accept our offerings. To the shining ones, gods and guys of the older days, you who watch over each and every one of us. Our patrons and matrons, we offer you welcome. To all of you of this very place, you were here long before us, we offer you welcome. And to all of you who watch over us, whether it's known to us or not, we offer you welcome. Come, join us by our fires. Shining ones, accept our offerings. Shining ones, accept our offerings. At this point, if there are offerings you wish to make, please feel free to do so. As I made offerings last week, as once again, those who are being affected by this horrible weather we've had throughout the country find the help that they need. Excuse me for one second. I realize I forgot an offering. Oh. 
<sighs> to all those who are in need emotionally and physically. <sighs> there are no further offerings to be made. Mighty Kendrick, we have given to you give to you one last time, we ask that with this offering that we get blessings in return. Mighty Kindred, accept our sacrifice. Mighty Kindred, accept our sacrifice. Mighty Kindred, we ask what blessings do we give you? The ancestors. The ancestors give us Aeolus, the horse, spiritual travel, spiritual work. And the land spirit. They give us Gabo, gifts in partnership. And the shiny ones. Oh, wait a second. Oh, the first one was Manos, so, because the last one is Awas, the horse. Wow, I'm having an off night today. <laughs> uh. I'm reading this as look at the reciprocity that happens between self and spiritual work. Self and spiritual work feed off of each other. The more you do of one, the more you'll get of the other. So focus on self, focus on spiritual work, and you will be greatly rewarded. I think these omens are good. Do we accept these omens? We accept these omens. Ancient and mighty ones, we have given to you a gift calls for a gift. Fill our waters in each and every one of our homes with the omens we have just heard. Fill them with manas and self, mankind. Fill them with gabo and partnership and gifts, reciprocity. Fill them with Aeolus, the horse, spiritual travel, in each and every one of our cups. Behold the waters of life. Behold the waters of life. Now, let us thank all of those who have aided us. Shining ones, gods and gods of those days, be our patrons, be you of this place, or be you unknown to us. For all they have done for us throughout the days and all you do have done for us tonight. Shining ones, we thank you. Shining ones, we thank you. Land spirits, be your animal kin, our plant kin, or the unseen kin, for all you do for us throughout the days and all you've done for us tonight. Land spirits, we thank you. Land spirits, we thank you. And to the ancestors, be you our family, be you our chosen family, or be you of this very place, for all they have done for us both throughout the weeks and throughout the night. Ancestors, we thank you. Ancestors, we thank you. And gatekeepers, once more, you have aided us. You have watched over us, including watching these grow up. And yet, we got these wonderful moments. So for all that you have done for us, gatekeepers, we thank you. Gatekeepers, we thank you. We ask that you once more join your magic with ours in my house and all of our houses. Let the wells become but water once more. 
the fires become but flame once more. Let the tree become but a tree once more. Let the gates be closed. Let the gates be closed. And last but not least, Earth Mother, your first in our thoughts, your last in our thoughts. For you, without you, we would not be here. And to you, we will return in the end. For all that you have done for us and all that you will do for us. Earth Mother, we thank you. Earth Spirit, we thank you. And go now, children of Earth, in wisdom and peace. For this right has ended.